Now we're back to this shit. I gotta follow this road. Keep going, take a right on my first right, take another right, keep going, keep- and we'll be there, because this is what I've been doing this entire fucking game. Oh god, I turned my blinker on. Can I just sell all of these? So, Zach. Oh, Jesus. About Emily. My first impression of when we met her on that bridge is slightly different from what I think about her now. Did I have a shining gun. Something? It's like, no, again. <laughs> she seemed interested in you. Did you make a move on her? No, don't answer. I'm just asking. Well, I get six but if you like for her, doing this? I won't stand in your way. But I'd like to hear the truth. Because this kind of stuff could affect our friendship, you know. Anyway, sorry, I was You're talking fine. Out. I'm just interested in her, that's all. York's talking to Zach. Zach's in his brain. <laughs> He's just talking while we're driving the car, so it's not so quiet. Oh, God, I can't control this fucking car. Alright, well, I wasn't exactly anticipating you starting to stream this soon, so... That's my problem. It's fine. I forgot what day it was. I have to get through this. It was seven hours. It was seven hours yesterday of just fighting this game. Fighting the game. I didn't play. Like, don't you love those textures? Can't you see the speedometers on this dashboard? And if I I'm turn gonna... just sharp enough, I might be able to flip my car onto its side for a brief moment sometimes. It just happens. This sounds painful. But also, I could just be like this. Break! <laughs> Waiting. Wait. Whoa. Oh! I like how your arms just stay in places if your body didn't... Oh, I got my blinker on. <laughs> I should crash into a tree. <laughs> Also, they added a blinker system for some reason to let you do, like, when there's no reason for it. <laughs> there's no reason. Not oh, all right. Made it to my destination. <laughs> I can't. I'm the cool FBI agent. <laughs> can't wait for that second one when I play it on Sunday. Wait. I think the Seven. game rele the game releases. Oh, I for some reason my brain put a two into Just this, so said. I thought you were already playing the it's second. I'm like, wait, I thought playing. the second was coming out. I didn't. <laughs> All right, everything makes sense now. Yeah. Life is good. Welcome to graveyard. I like how this is a, the character's first time visiting, but I already was here because I needed a place to sleep hey, the Brian. past time. Agent, Mr. Agent, how are you? This is a great oh, game. The voice bad. acting is top notch. I'm uh just playing a little game with Harry. Game? A game? Oh, is that fun? We've only just started, Brian. The fun is about to begin. I'd like to ask I'm also wearing the special. cherry blossom shirt, so is it gives me max sex appeal, which matters to nothing. Seeds. I just wanted to wear it. Seeds. Mm -hmm. Red seeds. That that tree does. And that one. Oh, I like how we had to ask, and that one too. which tree produces oh, red seeds? Huh, maybe if we looked slightly off to the right, we would have noticed the red trees. Christ, I'm waiting. Okay, I'm going to mute for a little while while I get my workout in, but I'll be listening. But don't worry, I'm going to... Oh, a green tomato! Truly this... Oh, a green tomato! <laughs> Out of context, I can only imagine this making more sense. Oh, green tomato! <laughs> like, not actually watching the game will make it more understandable. As usual, I gotta save any chance I get, so I'm just gonna be like, FBI, I found a green tomato. Are there just an infinite amount of green tomatoes? Yeah, just because this is an area you can sleep to pass time. So if you were to pass time, your hunger will go down and you have to oh. eat. What does okay, hunger... Like, how is tomatoes related back to sleeping? Well, I, I know I There's just... a hunger mechanic? Yeah, and it's sleeping mechanic. Anyway, uh, don't... Why? Uh, Gravekeeper, don't mind me. I need to get past the wooded barricades. Oh my god, they had Resident Evil 5 aiming. <laughs> yeah, Resident Evil 4 and 5 aiming. I like right. how... Oh, sorry. 
I like how this is all, like, in my head. Like, these are me just battling demons, like, in my brain, I guess. Because no one ever sees or notices any of this. All the supernatural shit is just all in his head. Amazing. So literally, I could just be walking and somebody just sees me zone out for a minute. <laughs> so wait, does he have, like, is it like a yes. game where he's like, has schizophrenia or something? Or, like, I don't know, he keeps sure he's, he's talking to a voice, at, uh, like, to someone in his head named Zack. But there is no Zack, except you learn more about who the hell Zack is at the end of the game. Hmm. It's more like a, uh, if I recall from just a little bit that I remember, I think, like, I, I think your character actually is Zack, but uh, after traumatic things happened, Zack was put to, into what they call the Red Room to recuperate, and York takes over. <laughs> of course. So, that's just kind of how this is going. Like, we, we're just two different personalities, I guess, or two different people in one body. I don't know. It's a masterpiece. Um. But uh, what I wanted to say before, I forgot I didn't talk to you on Sunday. I got uh, roped into playing Resident Evil 2 again. This time Leon's campaign. Good. And I have to say, I do, I thoroughly enjoy Resident Evil 2, at least the remake, considering I never played the original. But. Well, the original is similar. It's just that there's uh, a little bit less, like, dialogue between certain things because, like, it was. A different voice acting type thing back then and you know hmm. less animations and things are different like when you finally uh did you beat leon's campaign no i got right to the end uh yes. where you basically you get to like the underground uh, uh, umbrella facility all right so you've already went past kendo the gun shop guy yep. Yep. see that dude there there's he's right in the beginning of resident evil 2 original and he has no like he doesn't mention there's no say of his daughter so, like, some oh. characters are more fleshed out, like Marvin, who you run into in one of the campaigns for, uh, which was the first cop you run into that's alive. He's only there for a brief moment to, like, tell Leon or whoever you're playing as to, about, like, what's going on and then tells you to leave. And then that's the last you see of him until you re-enter that room. Like, I he's... Say both there's, um, both campaigns between uh, Claire and Leon, coincidentally, I managed to uh, take over from my friend at uh, when they're when both Claire and Leon reached like the uh, underground parking lot, like from the like when you like the first time you kind of walk in underground the uh, police station yeah, that... parking lot, like that's where I took over coincidentally both times, like where you have to go up to the yeah, um, and then you get thingy. good old Chief Irons as Claire, or you get Ada as Leon. Mhm, mm exactly. Um. And that's where I took over. I, I don't Dear remember. God, I fell in love with Ada. Anyway. It's funny, is a lot of people, like, say that, like, you know, don't give us a love character for Leon right now, or, like, Ada's not worth it because of all the secrets. And then other people are like, we love Ada. Also, will these guys stop? Can I move on? No. <laughs> um, I'm stuck here forever. But, uh... <laughs> this is your existential nightmare. This but is your But Chief story. Irons was not, or whatever his name is, was not as crazy, like... As he was in the remake, if I recall, because I barely, I don't remember him much. He was a lot more like calm, like demeanor, but more like psychotic, I guess, yes. than like a lunatic in the uh, in the remake. Bullseye. Great. Great. Oh, but I don't believe I met the character, so at least well, not yet. Well, if you were Claire in the parking lot, you yes. ran into it. Oh, I know. Yeah, I know you said it, but. Because that's the dude that takes remember. that takes the little girl away from you. Him. Yeah, the asshole that takes the girl away because he's the police chief. Okay, yeah, that's my regret. Um, because at that point I was like kind of half taking it seriously because I my friend just wanted me to like beat apart because it was whatever. And then the more I played, the more I'm like, oh, it's less actiony and more puzzly. I fucking love this game. Yeah, and that's why. Way more serious. That's why people were like upset. Like four, everyone loved because there was still some puzzles, but like. Yeah, I think people enjoyed it because it got a little more action-y, but then they went overboard because people... They, it felt like the people who were making Resident Evil were just like, oh, they like the action. Give them more of that. And they went with that with 5, and then people were... 5 got, like, an okay reception because it was, like, action, but I think more people just enjoyed the co-op. They're like, all right, yeah, exactly. more action and co-op, and 6 just went overboard with every character. <laughs> mm. 
Yeah, no, I mean, I'm thoroughly, like, I honestly, Easy. Resident Evil 2 is, like, bumped up on my, like, favorite games list kind of a thing, because of just, I love the puzzle aspect and the survival aspect, like, I don't want to shoot every bullet. It's, I mean, it takes away the action. I freaking love that. I, that, yeah. Yeah, I mostly never Amazing. fired my gun until, like, half two boss fights. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Usually how I try to, or if I needed to keep a room clear for an area I need to get to, or I was going to come back frequently. Gotcha. But really, I tried not to fire my uh, my stuff. But it, like I said, that was how the old ones were. It was just a lot of uh, running around, backtracking, finding keys um, to progress. You backtrack just to get to some other area that, because now you finally have a key that took you forever to find. Like, that's just how a lot of them were, except the only difference was it's like, I think the first one was all about being in a mansion, so. Yeah. But the mansion was a giant puzzle of keys. Did they make a remake for the first? They did, right? They only remastered it. Remake, gotcha. So did it only. Did 3 get a remake? Sorry, yeah, I don't 3 got a remake, but people don't enjoy it. Like, it's about the same thing. It's just that, uh. There are moments just like Mr. X where a uh, where Nemesis pops out after you because the whole idea of that game was Nemesis chases you. Um, it's not bad and it takes place before and into uh, Resident Evil 2. Interesting. Um, and it's like I don't mind it, but it is really short because there is no like different scenarios. It's just one, and it's like some things are cut from what the original had that people were. But I still enjoyed it, and I don't, like, I can't remember every, Jesus Christ, all these fucking spawning enemies. I don't remember, uh... Um, you have made no progress. I finally burned through all this machine gun ammo, because this gun sucks, and it's taking up inventory space. Um, but yeah, it's a little bit shorter, and a lot of things are cut that people don't like. I don't know, you could just, like, read up what things are wrong with it that people would be hardcore fans but if you just wanted like something to play and you you know never played the third one like the original like you haven't then you probably will still find enjoyment if you like to yeah i freaking i'm love i seriously cannot emphasize how much how much i freaking love I'm, I'm trying to I think surprised. i'm trying to think i recall a lot of like that's what it was with three it, it, it's hard for me to remember because it happened so quickly and i was more worried about my cpu overheating than anything when i played mm -hmm. that but uh there were there were times where there was backtracking finding items to that you would get yeah, later on i like how he found this perfect ice get cream scoop of seeds in his hand <laughs> Zach, oh, Mr. Yeah. Let's get back to harry he's fucking snorts it <laughs> But yeah, there's. About these seeds. You would be like, oh, you can't enter this. Well, it's right locked. Here, and then you won't knows. find, like, the lock pick until it's later on in can't the can't section. And then you can backtrack to go find these We're optional areas that you don't need to go into. Or some of them would actually be important because they hold a key item to unlock another door. You know, there's still that same aspect. Mm. It's just, uh, I think some parts maybe feel a little rushed, possibly, in 3. But I don't know. I didn't have a problem with it. For someone who enjoyed 2, I still uh, I had my enjoyment of. Uh, of three, but then again, I had just played the original. Oh, good! I found a left foot bone. Nice. A human bone. Anyway, this uh, doesn't look related to the case, but shouldn't I let someone know? But yeah, it, it's not bad. Yeah. No, oh, good to know. Uh, I mean, it might be on sale. Uh, it might be on sale right now because of the Steam stuff. It's on PC. Gotcha. Uh, my friend has a PS4, and it'd be, like, fun to go through just for that, because it's like, once I beat 2, it'll be like... I don't know. Well, you don't want to save it and come over and we experience it? <laughs> you are in a basement with spiders, man. You have no <laughs> idea how much that terrifies me. I mean, you do know how much that terrifies me. Then I'll just we do it in the winter. There's no such thing as spiders in the winter. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, does somebody, should somebody tell him? No, let him have his peace. <laughs> the only way. Because I cover myself up in, like, blankets upon blankets, just covered in, like, the fucking raid uh, bug spray. <laughs> it's like, oh, I can't God. breathe. You smell like poison. <laughs> I can't breathe, but damn, am I protected. <laughs> all these shotgun shells, and all I used was the machine gun. Well, the gravekeeper's gonna be like, why the fuck are all these bullets here? <laughs> Look at all these bullets around here. All these bullets. 
to save the game. Bad, bad seeds. I, I won't touch it. But Brian, I need to... What do I do with this bone? I can no longer see your game. You I'm don't. gonna mute for like a little while. Why? Because you're gonna fucking work out? Hells yeah. You can sit and work... What's this? I'm just there. gonna listen out of context, and then when I finally get... I'm done in like 30 minutes to an hour, I'll explain what I thought of the game based on nothing but audio <laughs> clues from you. Well, I left the graveyard. <laughs> I'm not gonna have any idea what the fuck you're no doing. No one does. <laughs> yeah. Alright, let's get moving. I gotta figure out where the fuck to go. Wait, I just realized something. Hold on. I can see what you're doing. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't you? Can it's I... like, I like how you have to mute and talk, uh, just to work out, but then, like, I've heard you grunt and groan just playing a fucking VR game. <laughs> Well, I don't have to mute then. It's just a matter of like, I mean, I I just don't want to like whack my mic or something and then blow out your eardrums. But I can see what you're doing. This is cool. Where the fuck am I located? Where are you located? That is a good question. That's where I gotta oh. go. The I should be this way. So I go up, keep going straight, keep going to take a left at this road. Keep going straight and I should be there. So now I'm driving, John, because that's what we do in this game. Ooh, driving. But. Also, the reason why right in the beginning I told you what games I wanted to get is because I can't tell you the stuff with Brandon or DKs around because, god damn it, they, they keep doing their shit on, on purpose now. They keep sending stuff anytime I mention the want of a game. Uh, who? See? <laughs> this is why! <laughs> I can't tell you what I... <laughs> tell anybody what games I want. I failed the level. Anyway, <laughs> I can't I can't do this certain one with the mic on because I'm like trying not to breathe heavily or anything. <laughs> <laughs> no, really, I was holding my breath. I could only do it for like 30 Anyways, seconds, and at that point, I was just like, "There aren't mm -mm, any young mm -mm. women left in this town. Even Emily could be targeted next. We can't rule that out. All the more reason to catch the raincoat killer ASAP." Ah, so let's see. Let's check on how you're doing. Ah, you're driving. <laughs> yep, that's uh, only a thousand more yards to go. Wrong, Zach. I mean, I'm not interested in Emily because she's female or anything. I fucking love that. I can just, like, check up and like, press of a button. You know, as an interesting person. But by looking at her, she reminds me of something I used to feel. That's all. Like back when I first met you. Oh, Zach, we're here. Let's continue our chat later. Mr. Francis York. Jesus Moore. Christ, why is Finally, it so loud? You have this is... Welcome. You are welcome to come inside. <laughs> yeah, I can't mention what I like because Brandon's around. Or what games I'm interested in wanting to get. Or DK, they're both monsters. Also, my thing just said, welcome to the chat room again. I've reconnected. <laughs> <laughs> Time to call the phone. Apparently, I've been disconnected from my own chat for a while. <laughs> no! Oh god, we gotta do new shit now. Oh. Why can't it just be a walk to his door? Why do I feel like the game crashed because he just tried to move the piano? Is that normal? <sighs> Fuck. 
here we go. We're only 30 minutes in. <laughs> <laughs> I should have just fucking played the 360 version. <laughs> All right. What if I do this then? Oh, this is hard. <laughs> That's why this game is so long. It's because it's not the game itself, it's the crashing. <laughs> exactly, that's all the extended gameplay <laughs> length. The game teaches you how to, I don't know, troubleshoot. <laughs> that's the game teaches game. you how to traverse all the stages of Windows. This is why I'm glad there's a save, like, right before a lot of crap. The only one that sucked is I forgot to save before a tailing mission, so I had to follow a guy going, like, 20 miles per hour forever. Oh my god, the piano moved. It worked. Mr. Francis York Morgan? Please proceed to Mr. Stewart's room. There he awaits you, I shall assume. Does Mr. Stewart have any Stewart's coffee? Oh, come on! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I crashed on his face! <laughs> Damn it, I want to feel the look. Oh, come on, why? Am you? It's this York Morgan. <laughs> I gotta look at this face. I'm trapped in perpetual hell. Can't even screenshot it. <laughs> I can't even get to task manager. Oh, his face. Happy. He's like, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna rip one and then I'm gonna crash. <laughs> du, 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 du. Should just play the Naruto games. <laughs> Madara versus Madara wouldn't crash this shit. <laughs> How do they ever get funding for another? <laughs> How long? I don't even remember how, like, when this game came out and then how long they made a second one now. The console ones were abysmal for frame rate. Ah, uh, Dark Souls. <laughs> I was gonna say, that's what it is. It's like, just imagine being in, what was it, Blight Town or whatever the fuck? I don't remember the... Yep. Just imagine Blight being... Imagine being in that, but for the entirety of the game except for cutscenes. That sounds truly <laughs> atrocious. Especially on the PS3. It says what? I didn't say anything. And it's got an itchy trigger finger. You got what if I do finger. Windows Vista Service Pack 1? <laughs> How about uh, Windows XP? <laughs> you think it'll run past it? If I go backwards? I mean, mate, well... <laughs> what if you just went straight to Windows 8? Maybe the game was teasing you now. Oh, dear God, it opened in a... Oh, geez, this is a real... Oh, God, it did open up in Windows XP like the window is Windows XP looking. <laughs> <laughs> dear God. And you don't know shit. Not... Play your games. Buy yourself fucking a mansion. <laughs> oh. These are my comebacks when I've been... In... I'm all flustered. <laughs> Just tell people to go buy a mansion. <laughs> Mm. You know, some of these I have been playing this game for 10 hours total, but it sure as shit don't feel like that when like six, six of those hours have been fighting. Did that not go through? No, I see it. 
Oh, why is it text for me? Yeah, you might have to refresh the chat. Sometimes mine's been text. Mostly cheers have been text for me for some reason. Wait, I refreshed the chat and now it's gone. No! Come on. Turn it, you son of a bitch. Get past his face. Get past his face. <laughs> Mr. Oh, we got past it. <laughs> Windows XP was the answer. <laughs> Why? Why do I have to do this shit? Someone's going to be like, you just had to download this so you'd be fine. It's like, I did download every different fucking workaround and fix that they said, and it sometimes just doesn't work. Even people complained that the fix isn't working on certain areas and what to do. And I'm like... I can't, well, I can't restart my PC as a fix. 14, 23, fucking 26. 14, 23, 26. More umbrellas, what am I grabbing here? Where did she go and play Naruto? His favorite game on the Citadel. These musical notes part of Harry's game? Oh, have you ever shit. looked at Harry's game? <laughs> I have not looked at that. <laughs> Should I? Oh. All the doors are locked from the other side. It's like, no, they're just locked. Oh. Stuck in perpetual fucking Dark Souls 2 hell. <laughs> oh god, this puzzle, that's a 10, 50, 20, 20, 20, 14, 23, 26. But where am I? I gotta get to 20. Twenty six, twenty three, and then there's a fourteen. Fourteen, twenty three, twenty six, I think was what it was. <laughs> or just get it to this one and it'll light up. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Can't push too far. Push one back. Got it. Now I just gotta get to the other one to 14. Got all this crap just to talk to Harry. Bullshit. <laughs> just a miserable person to play this. That's why this, no. t this title is The Masterpiece Part 4 The Crashing. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> the last three were just called The Masterpiece, and then I'm like, you know what? The Masterpiece has become The Crashing. <laughs> the masterpiece. Oh, God. Somehow they made an amazing formula of just a terrible game into a great game, but then an awful port of an already garbage-like type game. I bought this game on a whim back for the 360 just because, like, I was in the mood for something kind of, like, creepy. You know, like, you get in the mood where you kind of want to play something that would be creepy or disturbing. And I remember looking at the box, and I was like, well, this is something kind of outside my usual range of what I want to play. Why not? And I, I think I paid like five bucks, ten bucks for it at GameStop, bought it way back, and then I played it. I was like, this is not what I thought it was. <laughs> the box lied. <laughs> The 
Sounds like someone just loaded a gun or cocked a shotgun. A save in here. That's all I want, because I do not want to push all of that again if we're going to crash going to talk to Harry. Hi, Michael. I'm just gonna run by. Okay, I guess right. He locked the door. Can't go back and save. Oh Jesus! <laughs> gonna blow up. Man, I miss playing this game in full screen. <laughs> People are like, "What do you mean it's full screen?" It's like, "Yeah, for you." The power of editing. <laughs> It's like, no, it's just the captures doing that. Exactly. But because of me putting it on these silly fucking window type things, these different packs and whatever. Tell me that's glass there and that's just not the door fucked up. I just don't know anymore. Oh god, I went out here on accident. <laughs> no! The horror! I didn't find a single save point, which has me horribly worried. Oh, please. Okay, didn't crash yet. We're okay. <laughs> really long... Never... Oh, no, no, they're yeah. moving. I just hear foots... Oh, there he is. He finally showed up into frame. Fist bump me, brother. No, the seeds. He just dropped <laughs> the seed. What, what Instead is of... that supposed to symbolize? Harry, was he planting a tree? In a house or a building? <laughs> and I'd like to hear more. God, the font is like something out of Microsoft Word. Oops. York, as you know, there's a powerful mystery surrounding You know, I actually just scenes. scrolled down and just saw how many You've seen them fucking at those things you finished on your stream. Yeah, I don't want to talk about it. And I'm it. not in that list. And you've seen them deeply involved with the murders in this town <laughs> as well. So you live That's by right. a waterfall. But how do you know all this? Uh... No. York, you must be younger than you look. Youngsters tend to hurry so much that they let things slip right past them. What you need to do is slow this down a bit. That way you'll see what's really important. Let me tell you. Just about when the communist Reds started to become a rising threat. Rising threat. Our town constructed a huge clock tower. Then, soon afterwards, a serial killer wearing a red raincoat went on a killing spree. The legend of the raincoat killer? Stop playing games with me, Harry. That's nothing more than folklore. The FBI has no such record of a multiple homicide case in this town. York, Anna, Becky, and now Diane. Their deaths are real, not folklore. Not Does that legend. guy dress you in the morning? The raincoat killer is also real. I find it funny that I don't know what you're just quoting out of the game and what you're just making up. Everything.
the military. Very good. The military. The melon. But if there are no records about it, then how do you know it really happened? Good question, York. Why would I know this? <laughs> Batman. The answer is very simple. I was there. God, the I animation. Was that a laugh or was he like, convulsing? What happened? How many times could I say new raincoat killer? <laughs> I get paid saying it all the time. His fingers are working to type. <laughs> York's like, I'm gonna smoke on this. Music starting to overpower his voice. This new fabricated legend was passed on from one to the next, evolving, changing every time, like a rumor. Some may have actually taken the seeds to try them out, to prove the legend that he is. York! Oh god, his voice suddenly got louder. Pick a microphone filter and stay with it. <laughs> None of the criminals we caught for the other murders ever mentioned anything like that. It's your job, <laughs> your role and duty to look into He said duty. Now, the game must go on. You know I said that the incident 50 years ago was totally erased. But it totally Not wasn't. Quite. Oh god, I gotta drive again? <laughs> if I ever do with this drive. Okay, it's worth a look. And we Because it's well uh man have his Grand Theft Auto wannabe. No, oh, Grand Theft Auto wishes it could be this. <laughs> <laughs> clear time I'm sure it does. Total clear time, nine hours so far, eleven days have gone by in this game, two hundred and twenty six enemies defeated, and three numbers of continues. Payment rewarded three fifty. Basic wage unpaid salary twenty four sixty. Funds total amount nineteen thousand six hundred forty six. I'm making money. <laughs> Sugar donut will satisfy a small amount of your hunger. Well, it's raining again. Documents from a case that happened 50 years ago. Let's play along with the old man for a little longer, shall we? Zach, that means we need to head for the sheriff's department. Oh shit, really? Here I thought we were going home. Oh, God, now we gotta go driving. I'm gonna turn my wipers on. It's raining.
If I mostly go straight for a while and then take a left, I should be there. It shouldn't be too complicated to get to the sheriff's department. Every time we're in this car, it's the only time this music will play. Only got 52 gas. Zach, picking up from where we left off. Anyway, Zach, there aren't many young women left in this town. Even Emily could be targeted next. I can't rule that out. All the more reason to catch the raincoat killer in the SAP. And that means working closely together. We can work out the Emily situation later. Don't get me wrong, Zach. I mean, I'm not interested in Emily because she's female. It is hot I'm just saying she's... Well, interesting. You know, as in being able to sit on the ground and just interesting have person. you uh but by doing your thing. Exactly. She reminds me of something I used to feel. This is the only way to watch streams now. <laughs> when I first met you. You know that. Getting gas! <laughs> fucking whipped it into the circle. I need gas. Five dollars a gallon. Can't believe how expensive gasoline has become. Well, actually, yeah. Jesus Christ. <laughs> It'll also cost me a total of twenty-nine sixty-six dollars to get it filled. Okay, two questions. Why is this called Heaven and Hell Gas Station, and why do you have nineteen thousand dollars in your back pocket? Uh, because I'm wearing a suit that gives me three times money, <laughs> and uh, also it's Heaven and Hell because the dude that comes out is kind of a dick, and the other his wife that comes out is like a hot it's flirty. Like a, kind of a vagina. Oh. He's like a flirty hot whore. <laughs> oh. So that's Hell. Um, now if I back up real quick, maybe Heaven will come out. <laughs> But, uh, <laughs> the real, uh, but when you mention, like, your nope, suit that gives you three times money, does that mean, hello, handsome, um, <laughs> does that mean you take the suit off and all of a sudden your money goes down to, like, No, uh, like it's just what I earn is oh, okay. three times. I just wanted to make sure. But I do have like, the, but I'm not wearing that suit right now. I have, that needs to get clean, because if it gets dirty, I have, like, flies that start to build up flying around me, and it's obnoxious in a cutscene. this game more of a life simulator than Animal Crossing? It's like, literally, there'll be flies around me. I guess because it's raining, maybe she won't come out. <laughs> it's always just him. Hello, handsome. But yeah, it's, it's like, over. I had it very dirty, and it was like four flies circling me as I went to, like, the cutscene had to play for me going to bed for the night. There's just like five flies around me in the sky. I'm like, I gotta get this suit off. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm wearing the cherry blossom, which it says will increase my sex appeal to max, even though there's no such thing as that, really. It's just as a joke. Ah. Oh, John, stop it. <laughs> Zach, picking up from where we left off. Anyway, Zach, there aren't many young women left in this town. Even Emily could be targeted next. We can't rule that out. All the more reason to catch the raincoat killer. And Might have been a people. left that I needed to take, that but oh well. Closely together, we can work out the Emily situation later. Don't get me wrong, Zach. I mean, I'm not interested in Emily because she's female or anything. I'm just saying she's interesting. You know, as in interesting in person. But by looking at her, that she reminds me of something I used to feel. That's all. Like back when I first met you. You know, that feeling we all used to feel back when we were kids. Feeling safe while also feeling a need to protect. That kind I gotta of sit here and let this play out exactly. or we gotta keep hearing the same fucking dialogue. Who made me feel that back then? Anyways, we're getting closer one step at a time to cracking this case. I have a feeling it's going to get tough.
I like when this thing morphs on to me because it's raining. You gotta have your little thing on. <laughs> your hands made you feel that way. I like how I paid a dollar to save and then it's like you were pay you just got rewarded forty two dollars for checking in. <laughs> First aid kit, small, recovers a small amount of health. York, I told you, it's nothing more than local folklore. Harry said that he was there. The raincoat killer is a phantom, made up to scare children long ago. I can't believe you fell for that from Harry, of all people. I agree with I like George. that I still have Emily in this fucking Harry outfit. And I don't know, every time I look at her, her body mind. seems so long. <laughs> George, Emily, of course I don't believe him word for word, but you won't mind if I at least try to confirm that he's wrong, will you? <laughs> this eyes closed? Now they're open. Well then, can you look for the files by yourself? I'm still looking for Thomas. Very well. Emily, open the filing room for him. Son of a bitch. I millimeter headgun FBI weapon. Oh, it's the this filing screen is creepy. That's the first time that I means, saw it. That means we're going into the creepy realm. So again, I'm gonna go fight my inner demons in the filing room. They're here too, Zach. <laughs> even though this might mean they're getting warm. Even though there was me. just like, let me in, let me go in there, and all of a sudden you just start hearing gunshots. It's like, you all right there, York? Just filing. <laughs> mm. But no, they don't hear any of the gunshots. It's all in my fucking head. I'm insane with power. Yeah, I was gonna say, this game is coming off more as a... I don't want to die. die. Wasn't... Was that uh, Indigo Prophecy or was that this one? It was this one where they say they don't want to die. Oh, Indigo I thought that was Indigo Prophecy. Indigo Prophecy is just a giant quick time event game. Was that the one where you took the pills after you weren't supposed to and died? Yeah, because I took them after I already had drank alcohol first and then I died mm. because of that. Oh, then I drank so much I jumped off my balcony out of depression. Because uh, that's what uh, happened in the game. He was like, well, that's how my story <laughs> ends. I fucking love that one. I mean, more or less, I just hear about all the ridiculous things that go wrong in it. <sighs> my god, they gotta clean this filing room up. Hmm. Gotta clean you up. I think they got clean more than just the filing room up, honestly. <laughs> Profiling start. The profiling room? Is that where the professional filers go? It's too much noise. We don't have any clues to understand what's happening. I would fix the antenna. Too much noise. Too much noise. They're still still missing, missing a vital, a vital piece, piece of, of the, the puzzle. clue. Puzzle. Let's begin. Forty-two dollars for extra profiling. <laughs> First aid kit, medium. I can't hold any of that. It's my favorite when I open these containers and I'm in one of these, like, fucked up rooms. And I just, mm. like, I open up a locker and I find smoked salmon. And I'm just like, oh, sweet, that's fresh. <laughs> well, smoked salmon does last for fucking ever. Well, then but... a turkey sandwich. Mm, not so much. Oh, he's choking me. Oh. Learning an issue that I, with my aiming, I can't aim that high. I think when I'm in this window mode, it's fucking with my ability to aim up, which is not good. I mean, I guess something's just above my uh, ability to aim up. We're screwed. 1950s, Brandon, what the fuck? 
I see it at the bottom right of my screen. It, fl it fucking filled up my entire b fucking tiny b like window. Oh what? Jesus Christ! <laughs> I. It just says my because again my game capture doesn't capture at times the overlay. About mm -hmm. six notifications just popped up that said Fire Prophecy has sent you a gift. <laughs> what did he send you? I can't look because if I alt tab, the game crashes. Oh. <laughs> Welcome to Windows XP. <laughs> Any of the older Windows don't let me fucking alt tab when I'm playing this game. Alright, I think I'm gonna be done with. I can't. Not anymore. I can't tell. Are you VRing or just doing workouts? Uh, uh, VRing, of course. I just didn't know because you like you didn't make it sound like you were putting on the VR. I just oh good 357 Magnum bullets. I think I missed my chance to get the Magnum in this game. Try to do it as stealthily as possible and then not breathe as much as often. Well, it's like I I heard the breathing, but like when you said workout instead of saying you were gonna go do like VR, I just assumed this is like my workout, bitch. I just assumed you were picking up weights and watching like a video. Like that's why you couldn't see what <laughs> I was doing. Head workout when I work out. Well, I just thought you were gonna watch like workout videos to follow their routines. Do I look like the kind of person to do that and work Fine, out? you no, would do I the can't. '80s style where they have like those VHS videos and it's like. <laughs> Dancing and all that shit to work out in Whoa. with the onesies. Oh, that? <laughs> Great. Oh, I'm a sweaty mess. An anal. <laughs> Amazing. Oh my god, I should probably take a shower first. Nah. Who's that? Oh my arm. Amazing. <laughs> that was like, let me door. Oh, damn it, I was gonna look at your profile so I can see what Brandon gifted you. No, I haven't accepted him yet. Oh. Great. Oh! Yes. Amazing. Army Simulator 19. <laughs> they haven't made a 20 yet. <laughs> <laughs> they looked at 2K20 and were like, we don't want the curse. Amazing. They don't want their developing team to leave them and then they have to scratch up for something. <laughs> Oh, jeez, I sneezed. It's amazing. It's all these monsters are- destroy all humans. Yeah, amazing. DK broke the rules yesterday. The oh, fuck, DK? <laughs> He's not here, is he? I don't know. I think I can see this shit. I, I, see I, ass shit. I assume not, because I'm boring. Great. <laughs> Is that the game I was looking at? Yes. Bullseye. Is that my wish list? No, it's not. Can't tell if the game always had it where it was an issue to aim or it's... Oh boy, or if it's broken. Alright. I know, maybe, I don't... Oh, actually, I can't test it. I was gonna use the controller, but, uh, you have to quit the game, go into its launcher, and tell it to be on controller. <laughs> Oh god, my nose. Aren't, aren't games just grand? <laughs> you know... How did I kill him? Man, that spread! <laughs> Looked like he just fell, like he couldn't limbo anymore. He's like, can't limbo with the best of them. I limbo too hard. Alright, well, well, you limbo too hard, or your friends limbo too hard, whoever the fuck limbo's too hard, I'm gonna go make myself wet. Why can't you bring the vid the video in with you? <laughs> Cause that would be probably getting you banned on Twitch. No, oh, I bet you're watching while you're in the show. Oh. Just have the audio playing. <laughs> oh yes, this have, is what I want. Just have the audio playing while you're you know, while you're just well, off I'm your phone. Oh yeah, the f off your phone or something, so then when you come back, you can be like, Alright, why did I hear, oh god, the hand is in my throat? <laughs> what if I continue talking like this? Then you're leaving. <laughs> <laughs> no. Alright, I'll be back. No. I almost just shut off my computer. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be back. Power <laughs> off. <laughs> Actually, do I want to be on my computer or do I want to be... Where do I want to be? Great. You want to be on your computer. Here, on the computer, where the computer rides. No, I should give the switch a break. What the fuck will I do here? Satisfactory. 
I don't feel like thinking. Factorio. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> Great. I'm just saying Great things, challenge. and I'm like, I really hope it's the correct name of the game, but if it's not, John will correct me. <laughs> I will be back. Diablo, uh, but on PC. <laughs> God damn it. And I wish I got the Magnum. Only a case admission, I guess, gives you it. And I think I missed that. Great. I don't remember there being so many goddamn spawned enemies. Wait, I found some coffee. I hope no one attacks me, I gotta clean my nose because oh my god, I keep sneezing and it's bothering the shit out of me. Oh, it hurts. Yes. Great. Nice shot. A lot of shotgun shells dropping, but I don't really want to use it. Not right now. I want to use it against the stronger, obnoxious enemy. I found the red seed. Hmm? Oh, it was the pizza? It was alright. It was okay. We got it from a different place that wasn't around here. Towards my old living arrangement places back near the trailer park. We tried it. it. Wasn't bad, just greasy, but it was because I had pepperoni and that shit is greasy as all hell. I didn't know what I really wanted. I must file. <sighs> I came. Steel pipe. Bitch. All the shotgun shells. Get off me. I don't remember if you... All the fucking things. He turns around like, are you putting this on video? Don't film at me. Amazing. I feel like I can aim lower, but it's... I'm stuck in an even smaller box that I'm actually playing in for aiming right now. Bullseye. Amazing. Good shot. Bullseye. My aiming is so fucking limited. Nice shot. Great. It, like... Aim very high. Great. Nice shot. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God, he's gonna shoot. 
What the fuck? Did he just say nice shot because the guy missed? Was he taunting him? You're getting cocky? I was gonna be like, you're wasting the machine gun ammo. Use the pistol. I'll be like, I don't care. This machine gun shoots its damage is weaker, and I don't really care. I drank a root beer and an egg. Nothing gets you going quite like a root beer and an egg. I feel so alive for the very first time. I ate an egg and drank a root beer. Oh god, can't see. Oh Jesus. No, nope, no, nope, I don't. No, sir, I don't want to make out. She's like, you smell like root beer. Jesus Christ. Holy shit, it's my shadow. Like, who's that handsome fellow in the ground? Time to smoke and profile. <laughs> it gets me going for the rest of the day. It's a nice egg and root beer. Maybe even put them together. Looks like we need to continue our search for the documents. George, I'll get right to the point. It looks like someone else has just removed the documents I'm looking for. Huh? Who would have done that, huh? The cabinet looks like it had been forced open. That's impossible. No one could break into there. No, Emily. There is one person that can access that room at any time. Me. You don't mean Thomas? It's too early to speculate. And profiling is my job, remember? More importantly, Emily, could you get me a coffee? A fresh one, if possible. Coffee? At a time like this? <laughs> Why now? Emily, please. This is very important. Some coffee. And bring some milk on the side. I need to base all my facts on coffee. Zach, you know something, don't you? I'm Not really. You. So tell me what you know. Maybe she would be nicer to get it if you explained that this helps Zach communicate with you. But then again, she'd be like, what the fuck is wrong with you? Ugh. Zach, this is amazing. Even the taste of her coffee is thrilling, to say the least. What? No, nothing. This isn't the cup that Thomas always uses for me, is it? I'm sorry about that too, Ben. <laughs> I just used a cup that was nearby. You have a problem with that? Problem? Not at all, my dear Emily. The coffee is perfect. Well, okay, taste aside, this cup certainly is perfect. The big fish are biting at Velvet Falls. George? 
Emily. We're going to Velvet Falls. There's something waiting for us there. I can feel it. You're... Are you joking? You're trusting your cup? No, Emily. Going to a waterfall just might be a good idea. In feng shui, a waterfall is known to be a source of power. Even if we find nothing there, I'm sure it will give us some power. Thanks for the vote of confidence, George. And don't forget to bring a fishing rod. All right. I'll go get it. Fishing? <laughs> She's like, what the fuck? Are you too serious? George, do you have a net? There's like, I like some quality man-on-man -man time. money need more if I had my suit turkey sandwich it's an unbelievably delicious turkey sandwich that will satisfy a large amount of your hunger Zach, I hope we can catch a big one. This is the only time I'm fishing, because I don't have bait or anything for it. Like, this is the only time we'll do it. Like, I never buy a rod or do any of that. I don't know the point of fishing if it gives us food. Like, other than that, I've never done it in this game. Yeah, necessary fishing. What the fuck? Emily's face! Well, look at that. A health kit, chocolate, or a lollipop. This doesn't look like the documents we need. Try again. But I mean, can't we keep what we got? You fucker. Almost got blowjob face. <laughs> anyway, got the document. We've caught something to brag about now. In all the history of the FBI, I'm probably the only one who fished out documents thrown into a waterfall. Don't you think so, Zach? I just don't believe it. Files from a waterfall. Emily, look! Emily! <laughs> look what I found! You doubted me! I almost got your face! For eternal life and eternal power, make four human sacrifices on rainy nights, each after eating the seeds. Two, make sure the sacrificed eat the seeds too before they die. Sacrifice must also not speak while they are being killed. What does that all mean? Emily, come on now. It's called The Legend of the New Raincoat Killer. George, have you ever seen this handwriting? <gasps> yes. It's Thomas's. No! George, Get. I need to take these documents to Harry. He said he'd tell me everything once I take the docs to him. Those are classified. I can't allow a civilian to view them. Especially that deranged old goat who owns most of the town. I agree with George. Harry is... How can I put it? He might be dangerous. Yeah, I crash every time I'm trying to you put an umbrella into his fucking statue. You said it yourselves, didn't you? There has never been a 
mass murder case in this town. That means these documents pertain to a case that never actually happened. Just look at it as though they never actually existed, either. Ridiculous. York, I'm sure you've got a plan or something in mind. Okay, you have my approval. George, are you sure? Emily, we need to continue looking for Thomas. Our search may just have become a hunt. Yes, get on it. I'll go see Harry alone. Okay. Her body just seems all out of proportion to me. I don't know why. I wouldn't believe it if I hadn't seen it for myself. But Thomas? There's got to be a rational explanation for this. There's another Thomas. Zach George has started to change. I think the deaths of Becky and Diane had a deep effect on him. I guess this town truly is without a king now. If only we would have made him happy with a blowjob face. Then George would have been real happy. Man, he's a train. Yeah. How are we gonna catch Thomas the train now? Okay then, Zach. Wearing a red raincoat. Another visit and get to the bottom of all this. I have to admit, I do like spending a bit of time investigating alone. I'm getting a bit sick of being told that I'm either too slow or too fast. You agree with me, right, Zach? What? I'm listening to music in your brain. Jesus, where the fuck did you come all the way over there? I was going to see if I could still fish. Could I get another Emily blowjob face? Problem is, it's such a fucking run. I know I don't own a fishing rod, but I was wondering if it would let me. So apparently, tastes. Oh, Kason, maybe he has the mission for me. Maybe I can get the magnum. Oh, God. I don't want the kids to be put in any danger. All right. You. I don't know. You. I don't know. You have a mission for me, but I guess you don't want to put him. Get him off the road. The dog. You. You. Where are the kids going to sit? Can they all fit in there? Um. You don't want them to be in danger, but. Okay, said that's. Okay, said. How are you going to go anywhere with flat tires, Kaysen? <laughs> Looks like the kids are put in danger now. They don't... Oh, he's getting in. It only took a couple gunshots with the kids figuring, figuring it out. But now how does Isaiah get in? Oh, oh okay. And the dog? You gonna actually jump in? Why are you guys so slow about this? Also, apparently I have a lot of time. No, I don't. I'm in the middle of it. All right. No, I got a few. Look. Drive! Get out! What the fuck? Don't honk at me. You. D you. Me? Casey, okay, so get out of the car! Get out! Red to re. Fine. If I had more time on my hands, I'd tell you, because I want to see if the mission you have would actually give me the magnum or not. Somebody said there was a mission he'll give, he'll do for an infinite magnum, or at least a magnum. Well.
get the hell out of here. Maybe Case is going back to D4 or whatever and you just get the hell out of here. Maybe he'll stop breaking my fucking game. Jesus Christ, we are just in the middle of butt fuck nowhere. Alright. Can't believe it. We've only been an hour in. Brandon already broke the rules today. I've had I, 15 minutes in crash. Hey, Case, I. We can take a rest if you're tired. Uh, shortcut. Five dollars. Ah, so many fives. Oh god, you're still driving. Yeah, damn right I am. Taking a shortcut. <laughs> oh, now DK's in chat. Dead damn it, DK! <laughs> he hasn't done anything yet. <laughs> this is from before when he wasn't in chat. <laughs> I was gonna say, it's like it was Brandon who broke the rules today. <laughs> yeah, but this is for whatever reason you said before. Well, you're the one who found out. <laughs> to destroy so all humans. So it's my fault. <laughs> <laughs> so for finding out, it's my fault. He didn't do anything. I told him not to do it. Wait, but he's the one who... What? <laughs> <laughs> Where you am I? <laughs> you make a very good lawyer. But sir, the victim... <laughs> I told him no. <laughs> well, he must be free. He's free to go. I don't think I should have went there. Where am I anymore? Okay, this should take me back to a road, and then I'll be... Okay, then I'll be there. Oh, dear God, I hope so. <laughs> I, want, I went to screw the rules yesterday. Yeah, he screwed those rules. And Brandon did so today. <laughs> they keep breaking rules. I tell them not to, because I don't deserve this. <laughs> what the hell was that? What the fuck was that? What I just... Was that an animal? Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, he's gone. I had a vision. What the hell? <laughs> this place is crazy. <laughs> You're only now just saying that. <laughs> Yeah, everything's been normal so far. <laughs> Even though what you got. Yeah, because I can't alt tab this game. We're on Windows XP. You know how unstable this is. <laughs> Finally, Vista was too much. We had to take a step back and go to XP or forward and whoever's fucking mind. Poor car's at a 37%, 36% durability. So, where shall we go next? Is it, did Brandon get you Football Manager 2020? <laughs> no. I'm just trying to look at what games are on sale, because I'm assuming that'll help me. There's a right lot. <laughs> <laughs> I know. God, 
I hope I don't break down before I get to where I need to go. I'm at 20%. I keep hitting the walls. It's a very <laughs> tight figure. Uh, almost there. Just 200 yards. If I break down, luckily I have a flare to get another car, but it really would suck. <laughs> a gentle tap of the wall takes down a whole percent, but smashing through some wooden barricade is like, nah. God damn it. Made it. I'm back. Mr. Francis Jesus York. Christ. Finally, you have arrived. You are welcome to come inside. No. Why are you so loud? <laughs> it's always when the camera is like, hello there. <laughs> oh, creepiness again. Oh, God. Are we going into the fucked up world? I am so sick of being here. It crashes every time I'm in this fucking piano room or after. Go to payphone. Looks like the next game is hide and seek. Huh? Oh, save the game so I don't have to fucking drive again. I can't believe I have to come into this guy's house and pay a buck to use this phone. <laughs> Why does he have it in his big fucking rich mansion, John? Why does he have a pay phone? No. He's rich, and that means he's probably old, and old people don't know about cell phones. Uh, no, we are on... We went... Vista was crashing when I started the game up to come back to this guy after I went to the graveyard. So I have to... I went to XP. So we're on Windows XP right now. Oh, the 357 Magnum. I have a lot of money. It's only 6999.50. <laughs> John, look at that price. Fucking yeah. nice. Well, this is why I have the suit. I got the 357 Magnum. And that's my song. I'll even buy some bullets. Tropico 6. I already owned it. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm highlighting that. I'm looking right at your freaking <laughs> Steam icon. Never mind. He bought you Tropico 6 again. <laughs> See, even though I bought it the first time. Just start taking credit. I wish I had enough ammo to shoot this and just get rid of this pistol, but whatever. I'll save again, because you know I don't want to do all that. I need my suit. They don't give me my suit thing. I want to switch. I want to get the hell out of this thing and put on something. Money making. Money fucking what? Hmm? Well, isn't that weird? Do you see the resemblance? They're all the girls that were murdered uh, except for the one hey, that looks like Thomas. Looks like Diane. Um, yeah. And Carol. Zach, look. Emily. No. Not Emily, please. She's the only hot one. Guess I'll smirk. may be a creepy world, but it doesn't stop me from picking up this first aid kit small. And this high quality beef. <laughs> well, John, I found some high quality beef. This guy comes back, it's like, Mr. Morgan, where the fuck is my beef? I, I don't know. I didn't do anything to it. They're coming out of the ground! They're coming! Great. Bullseye. Nice shot. Nice shot. Great. Great. Yes. Action sequence completed. <laughs> 
I like that the action sequences have less enemy spawns than when I'm just casually walking somewhere and there's like 18 fucking spawns of them. Bullseye. Nice shot. Yes. Nice shot. Nice shot. Yes. Oh, yeah. Go. Keep doing it. Mmm. Damn it, Brandon! I haven't even been able to check! Stop breaking rules! <laughs> this fucking emote. The hell was that? Was that a baby? Is John a baby? Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> Baby dragon. No. Uh, Good, I can switch it to my right. suit. You're gonna say it. Money reward times three, the high roller suit. Looks almost brand new. Change. I was wearing the cherry blossom. Increase your sex appeal. Oh, you Benny. <laughs> I was wearing like a really ridiculous, like, red, obnoxious one, but I was like, I'm gonna wear this because I look like the guy from fucking New Vegas. Where's the chip? Wait, hold on. This came out first, right? I don't know. Then Benny. I don't know if it like did. Him? I don't know which came first. When did? Because New Vegas was out on the 360 and stuff. So. When did this game come out, John? Can you look? Because I right can't. Alt, I can't alt tab. Okay, so New Vegas was, wow, 2010? Damn. And I almost just... Great hell, I... Amazing. Deadly Premonition. I keep wanting to type in fucking Indigo Prophecy. I almost keep typing Deadly Promotion. <laughs> <laughs> Did I actually spell that right? Damn! Finally running out of machine gun ammo. Oh god. This game came out first. That what means year? Fall in New Vegas took inspiration from this. Like, no, there's no indication. Like, amazing. 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 What year did this come out? 2010. Oh, so they both came out in 2010? February 23rd was uh, Deadly Premonition, and October blah 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 was New Vegas. How did New Vegas get more sales than this game? <laughs> I don't know. Oh good, assault rifle bullets. If only I had an assault rifle. Okay, um, only because like I don't know what's going on, I have to ask this. Like, excluding all the glitches and that nonsense, is the story redeemable in this? It's interesting enough to where you want to know who the fuck's behind everything. Okay. Even though, like, all the murders that happen are characters you barely give a shit about, but it's like, you're interested to know why the fuck you talk to yourself, to a Zack character, who, the, who's doing all this, have all these weird characters and shit that you meet. Who could be behind it? I don't know. It's like, it's intriguing enough to just want to know what the fuck could be the end of this game. <laughs> like this, the toilet was covered in blood, and then once I flushed it, there was a flare inside. But I don't have enough inventory space. That did not space. look like blood. That looked like roast beef. I was going to say, it looks like a thing of meat just going <laughs> down. The toilet just glitching or into the not toilet. Not roast, I guess. Unroasted. Regular beef. Never mind. What's, what's, you know, beef, like, but not roasted? Ah, unroasted beef. <laughs> yeah. Some kind of unroast. I am so glad. Yeah, just what DK good. says. English is, this is a good game with a 2K one. Hmm. I'm gonna be stuck on the unroasted beef thing. 
all night now. To just like purposely screw up your tax when you someone asks you what you're making for dinner and you just tell them you're making unroast beef. <laughs> I'm cooking <laughs> unroasted beef. So you're roasting it. Unroast. Come on, John, look at that fucking explosion effect. Top of the line. <laughs> <laughs> we get glad it is in 2K20. Yeah, but you know, in 2K20, I can s turn into Jello and sink outside the hell in the cell. <laughs> 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 what? We need more games that just let you turn into Jello. <laughs> yeah. Think of us the glitches of like 2K20, but with a good story. <laughs> That's what this game is, and it's instead of wrestling, it's shooting. So, I pretty much because there hasn't been a whole lot released on the second one, other than it's a sequel and a prequel, because there's like flashbacks and things of certain stuff before the the first game of this one. Um, but. <laughs> There is one thing that I got spoiled on that apparently we're going to be able to do in the other game, the next game. Take a shower. No, ride a skateboard. Why? <laughs> I saw something about skateboards. I'm like, I'm sold. <laughs> like, you know, like Tony Hawk and skate games and it's like, no. Watch out. Deadly Permission's taking up the skating. You can't get Ah! <laughs> it worked. Yes. Great. Great. Uh -oh. You know, this what would make this game great. If I was just running around as an FBI agent and then I suddenly get a call and someone's like, We're we work with a different branch of the FBI organization. We'd like to hire you. How about this contract you get signed and then afterwards they're just like you need to get lose like a hundred pounds before the end of this day or you're fired. God damn it. I'm, <laughs> fuck. I wish you got to play that. Or no oh, yeah, Saturday I was fucking too tired to Emily. Play. Yeah, well, Saturday all we did was 2K20, so... At times we must purge things That is a bad 4th of July. <laughs> <laughs> no, we did the most American thing, wrestling. <laughs> God. Stop! Stop! You know, I wish I could see what you're playing, John, but because I'm in a small box, the font for Steam is even tinier. <laughs> so it just said basic flute. Did you see that? <laughs> just a blur. Must be getting tired. Just narrow time it. One day I'll play it. Probably hate you it. Want it, right? Yep. Yes. I bought it. Wait, what'd you say? Huh? <laughs> I'll play it. Fucking work of art. Don't you dare. You'll never play a game with a finer ass in it, alright? Yeah, I hope Deadly Premonition it is just underground where Eric just constantly tries to shit on me for me being a better skater than him and tries to backstab me. And it's like, who's Eric? <laughs> York is you actually think, from Jersey. Do you think you're actually going to beat this tonight or are you just pushing through? Oh, I'm just going to do as much as I can. I got till Friday, so. Mm. Just doing as much as I can in one stream like I've been doing. Yes. Monday was a bit shorter. I only did like four hours yesterday. Was or Sunday was shorter. Monday was about seven hours of this fighting through fucking crash after crash. Ugh. All right. I don't know. More than like curious. Uh, it's probably mostly this week is just this game, and then once I finish it, I continue on with my other stuff, and then. This game comes out, or the second game comes out this weekend, so I'll play it on Sunday. The next weekend's that ghost of whatever the fuck you pronounce it game that uh, Ubisoft's making. That's ghost of, of whatever it starts with a T, I think. Tom Clancy Ghost Recon. I don't know. Ah, here we go. This is a new error <laughs> I just got for the game. Usually it just crashes or freezes. 
but mm-hmm, instead but I, I got a runtime error. Program, app, whatever, deadly premonition director's cut. And the application has requested the runtime to terminate in its unusual way. Please contact the application support team for more information. <laughs> It just says Microsoft Visual C++ Runtime Library at the top. (laughs) There was a try-catch fail. (laughs) No one's going to know what I'm talking about.